welcome to the After Effect, where I will answer some of your fan questions. Thank you for writing these in at hashtag AskMichaelCarbonaro. Bernie writes in, when you're at a restaurant that run out of oil and vinegar, do you just ask for a side of olives and grapes? Yes, as a matter of fact, I do. In fact, if you go to a restaurant, they don't have fresh ingredients. You just squeeze some olives, make your own. It's not only more delicious, but it's better for you. That's going to be the tastiest olive oil you ever had. Marshall says, did any of your pranks ever go wrong? Legally not allowed to answer that question. George says, I'm a manager at a restaurant, and you have great customer service skills. Yeah, I, I'm oh. sorry. I'm using my fingers That's here. That's all right. You're getting a new one at this point, right? Well, I'll get you a new pizza. All I feel right. terrible. Well, thank you, George. That was sort of a hashtag compliment, Michael Carbonaro, but I do like that. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, you got to be nice to the people. They're not going to be nice back. That's what it was. The tomato wasn't cooked. Oh, my God. That's what Wait, they call that. still eat this. Of course. Yeah, we'll cut half of it. You could eat the other half. Cheers. Denise writes a question here. Is the inflatable posture chart real? Oh, when I swallowed the balloon in the doctor's office? That uh, posture chart is, yes, it's real. It comes from a very early uh, medicine school on how to strengthen your back and your spine and also exfoliate the whole interior of your esophagus. Ray says, I'm confused. Is the Eric Weiss locksmith company a real locksmith company? No, it isn't. That was one that I made up. And there is a very particular reason why we used Eric Weiss. Does anybody know what it is? Come on, class. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I see that. A little, little much, isn't it? Eric Weiss is Houdini's real name. That was Harry Houdini. Before he was Harry Houdini, his real name is Eric Weiss. So that's what we thought would be kind of fun, doing a locksmith. Yeah, we're locks, Houdini, prank, got it? Yeah. All right, Sabrina says, and this is our last question here. Sabrina says, what inspired the locksmith switch prank? Um, that one, you know, that was something I think I thought of in season one, but we could never quite figure out the method to. And we came up with other versions of it. If you remember, there was one where I got locked inside of a newsstand in the middle of a park and my hand suddenly shot out from inside the newsstand. How'd you get in there? Oh yeah, it was locked. From, well, it was locked from the outside. Oh. A little metamorphosis. That's actually what that inspiration is. Harry Houdini, Eric Weiss, his illusion, the metamorphosis, where he and his wife would switch places. So that was the inspiration for that. Here, you sit here for me, Zach. Yeah. And if you would focus the laser right there, it's going to take a second. Hold on. Oh, I think you got it. Yeah? Great. You guys are quick. Yeah. Thank you guys for writing these in. Love answering them. Please continue at hashtag AskMichaelCarbonaro. You can do that on Facebook, and you can do that on Twitter, and I will get to them, and I will see you guys again. Thanks for watching.